in uh, 2014, one year ago, we started with this new uh, pro uh, surgical procedure um, to take care about women that have to go to uh, nipple sparing mastectomy for breast cancer. And for this kind of patient, uh, which are the 30%, around 30% of uh, um, uh, patients with breast cancer, uh, we offer a new operation using the robot. Uh, this procedure uh, it is called nipple sparing mastectomy with uh, um, uh, robotic uh, uh, guidance and the surgeon uh, it's not operating on the table but is operating uh, um, very near to the patient and uh, using his brain of course and using his hand he is moving a console uh, which is uh, linked with uh, the instrumentation on the patient. The advantage of robotic approach to the breast surgery is the mini invasiveness and the uh, minimal surgical scar which is hidden in the axillary fold and is completely invisible. Um, so this uh, allows uh, more cosmetic result and more satisfaction for the woman undergoing the demolitive surgery as mastectomy. Initially, we started to enroll for this study a patient with a, a familial history of breast cancer. Um, and so we perform a prophylactic mastectomy. And uh, after the first results, uh, we noticed that the operation could be performed also for all that patient affected by breast cancer that should undergo to a mastectomy. Our study uh, began um, as a consecutive studies to, uh, and it was a, a feasibility and safety study of this, this new uh, surgical technique. After the first cases that we had no complication, post-operative complication, uh, we started uh, with uh, uh, um, to think about a prospective study, uh, comparing two groups of patients uh, which uh, uh, undergo to nipple sparing mastectomy and immediate breast reconstruction. The end point of this study is, of course, to check and to, um, to study the um, post-operative complication uh, uh, rate and of course the local relapse rate in the future and overall survival but especially because this is a, a surgical technique studied for the, for the women is to understand uh, the difference in the satisfaction of the patient. So up-to-date results includes uh, seven uh, surgical procedures, but one of them is bilateral procedure. Uh, the patient satisfaction was uh, very good after the surgery. The post-operative pain uh, seems to be less after the robotic uh, mastectomy, and even the hospitalization stay is less comparing to the normal surgical procedure. I think that uh, robotic surgery is the future of the surgery. So I would like to say that we have to uh, promote this technique. Uh, also, we are trying to start, uh, which is absolutely needed, a clinical trial to enclose the patients and to have really uh, important data about the firstly satisfaction, oncological safety and uh, um, uh, the feasibility of this procedure.